Before I start, you can get tabs for this lesson at my website, www.erichaugenguitar.com. Um, you can also find uh, my email and stuff like that to ask me any sort of questions you might have. I'm a very helpful person and I like to help people learn stuff about guitar, scales, tricks, tones, etc. Speaking of tones, let's talk about what I have going on with this guitar to uh, get the sounds that you're hearing. This is a 1966 Fender Mustang I uh, with uh, Tom Brantley custom pickups. This is I'm in the bridge pickup for this song, going into my Strymon Deco, which I'm using for some crunch. Um, and also I have it set for a little bit of chorus too, um, because you know it was the 80s when the Pixies did this. There's always seems to be a little chorus around. ever so slight, just a little bit of warble, really. Um, and then also there's some flint for reverb, a, a Strymon flint. And you're also hearing a Silvertone 1484 with a Jensen Mod 50 speaker uh, and a ribbon mic. So, Bone Machine, what a great what a what a really cool out there riff that um, Joey Santiago plays. So essentially the chord progression is D minor, A major, C major, G major. That's what Kim Deal's doing. And his great counterintuitive like melody that he puts on top of that, it's kind of based off of that D minor. It's a a uh, six and a five. And then I guess he was thinking A something blues-ish, because he does, he's up here at the seven bending. Goes down, five. This is where he's a genius. He uses the zero of the B. So you get. <laughs> it's great sound. It falls, but then it's open. And then just backs up. The, the chord went to a C, so he's grabbing three and three. And similar idea, grabbing this five, bending it up. But he probably realized it would sound dumb to do the same thing. That's too bluesy. So he does five, four, oh, which is actually a unison. So yeah, that gives you... tune real fast because that sounds a little squirrely. Oh, it's not that bad. So, what's neat that I noticed about it is it doesn't do that every time. It's every other time he changes that first chord. So the first time through it is. But then every other time it's just five and five. back up so it goes back and forth and, and truth be told you can kind of exchange them however you want I don't think the audience will know the difference but yeah try to and then the verse you're just rocking out with some bar chords just because, you know, I am not going to sing in these demos, I just cop the melody for the, that little chorus part, which is just a blues melody out of D blues. Um, and where am I? I am D blues that's on my fifth string. Easy to get to there. So I'm at eight and six. That's our little chorus melody. kind of reverses and then the little your bones got a little machine again I just do that because I'm not going to sing it what that is is the melody is that's seven eight 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 six eight if you combine that with the the rhythm chords that are underneath that's a seven, that's an E. Eight and eight. Hybrid picking it. This eight over here, because it's an F. This G over here. 
gives us, what is that? That is five, six, hammer on to eight. And then back around to the riff. Let me do that again slowly though so we can see it. And then back to the main riff. I think the only part you don't see me play in the video is it kind of goes through the riff some more times and then it does that at some point, which is the same chords as your bones got a little machine, just kind of power chord, E, C, F, G, and then back to the awesome. It's just one of those, you can kind of see where it came from, but it's just kind of out there and, and awesome. Great little riff um, and obviously great song because it's the Pixies. Well, I hope that is helpful for you. Thank you so much for watching.